Hello, in this video, we're actually going to take a look at some of the mathematics in this differential equations book. This is Differential Equations by A. Cohen, and it's a very, very old book. So in order to study differential equations, ideally you should know some calculus and you should be pretty familiar with some basic integration techniques. If not, you can still learn some of it, but you're going to have a hard time early on because there is a lot of integration. It's really not that hard though. It really isn't. Um, I think that there are other areas of math that are, are harder to learn, I think, than differential equations. I just feel like I always had um, an, an easier time when it came to learning differential equations. Uh, you know, I, I took the class and you know I did really well. And compared to other math classes I took, I felt like differential equations was one of my better classes. So I felt that it wasn't really that hard. And it's because you're basically using a lot of math that you've learned before, and then you're just kind of like reviewing it and you're learning a couple new techniques, um, learning some new concepts. So this book is An Elementary Treatise on Differential Equations by Abraham Cohen, PhD, College Professor of Mathematics, the John Hopkins University. Very old book on differential equations. Here's the copyright, 1933 by Abraham Cohen. Let's read part of the preface. The following pages are the result of a course in differential equations, which the author has given for some years to classes compromising students intending to pursue the study of engineering or some other physical science, as well as those expecting to continue the study of pure mathematics or mathematical physics. And the contents are somewhat surprising. It does have a lot of content for the size of the book. This does actually cover a lot of mathematics. So differential equations are solutions, okay, of the first order, applications, and then some additional methods, singular solutions, linear differential equations. Then we have second order ones. These are pretty easy. Integration in series, total differential equations, systems of simultaneous equations, and look, partial differential equations. I mean, that's that's pretty amazing that it actually has that in the book. And then look at this. We actually have answers. Really, really nice. Let's go to the back of the book. Let me show you the answers. It has answers to almost to almost every problem, which I think makes it awesome for uh, someone who is using this as a workbook type thing. It's a textbook, it's not a workbook. This is an actual math book with a ton of content. By the way, I don't know if this book is available. Like, I don't even know if you can buy it. I haven't looked. Um, I just wanted to make this video to show you this one from my collection because it's cool, but I don't know how hard it is to get. Um, but I will try to find it and I will leave links in the description uh, if I find it. It, it, it I, I don't want to say it's free because it's so old. I mean, it's got the word treatise in it, right? So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if this is something that is available in the public domain or or if you have to buy it. Uh, I'll try to find out. And if I do find out, I will leave links, especially if I can find it for free. Sometimes they have them for free on Google Books if they're in the public domain. But again, I don't know if this one is. So this, this is uh, some good mathematics here. So here we have what you learned at the beginning of a differential equations course. Yeah, there's exact differential equations. Those are always fun. I like how they introduce it here in like a very formulaic way. Um, but I guess they did some derivations. Or they did a little bit of, yeah, they're talking about it over here. Yeah, so those are something that you study in a differential equations class at the beginning, exact differential equations. Here's the very beginning of the book. A differential equation is an equation which involves differentials or one or more derivatives. Okay. Equations of this type arise in the analytic statement of problems in many fields. Right. Cool. So we've got some examples here. And then some more examples. We have classifications of differential equations. They talk about the different types, the order, the degree, what's ordinary, what's partial, really easy stuff. You know, and then talk about what is a solution to a differential equation, because everything needs to be well defined, right? So that when you go further in the theory, you know what what it means. So you have these fundamental definitions, and it's kind of cool because you learn a lot of them at the beginning of a differential equations course. Um, and I think that 
that often scares a lot of people. Like they, they jump into differential equations. Not a lot of people, but some people get nervous because um, you know, there's a lot of terminology right at the beginning. But th that kind of goes away later. Most of it is very computational. Derivation of the differential equation from its primitive. Cool. Yeah, so they're, they're coming up with... Yeah, look at that. Here's another one. Here, A and B are arbitrary constants differentiating twice. Cool. So they come up with a differential equation. Differential equations of the first order. Variables separated or separable. Yep. So you basically, you basically separate it. You put everything with an X on one side, everything with a Y on one side, you integrate. Like, for example, here... Yeah, they have some stuff going on. Let's see if we can find. Here's another example. This one, they write it this way. And they make a substitution. And then they integrate both sides. Right, they go from here to here. And they skip a lot of steps here. Um, they're doing some integration here. So that's what's happening uh, to go from here to here. It says to integrate the first term, let the square root of V be the new variable performing the integration we have. So they skip a lot of the steps uh, in this book. So it's pretty terse, which is one reason that it has so much content for the actual size of the book. So this is not like uh, a modern book where they show um, a lot of the steps. So this is a little bit harder, I think, than, you know, something more modern that's used today. I think definitely today's books are uh, easier than this one. And I'm not saying it's bad or it's good. I'm just saying it's it's a thing. Um, yeah, a lot of mathematics in this book. Look at that. Some trig functions there. Some applications. They have additional methods. Singular solutions. Let's see what it says about singular solutions. I'm curious because it's got um, a whole a whole chapter on singular solutions, right? So it says, okay, cool. Talks about envelopes. Yeah, so this is something that you might not see in, you know, a modern book. You're not going to have this much information on singular solutions. So that's something that you get from these old books, right? That's why I saw it. I was like, what is this? So that's typically not something that you see a lot of in modern books. So that's kind of cool. This is something you see in all the books. So this here, linear differential equations with constant This is something you'll study in any DE class. This is very easy, actually. So it's interesting looking through these books. You know, you see, you know, what's still being covered today. You know, when you're aware of, like, what's in the newer books and you look at an older book like this, you're like, huh. That's interesting, right? This has stuff that the newer books don't have. So stuff was taken out over time. And, and you wonder why. Um, and then stuff is added as well. So over time, things change. Ah, the method of undetermined coefficients. This is one that um, is also used in differential equations. So if you were to take DE in college, you would learn this. These, these take a lot more time, as you can see here. <laughs> Their first example is pretty intense. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, pretty cool book. Uh, I just thought I'd make a video to show you this one. Um, it's a book on differential equations. It's an elementary treatise on differential equations by Abraham Cohen, PhD. This is the second edition, completely revised. In fact, if I can find any edition or if I can find out if it's free or anything, I'll, I'll put some info in the description. Um, also, um, let's see, if you if you want to learn math, check out my courses, mathsorcerer.com or freemathfits.com. They're all on the uh, Udemy, Udemy platform, but if you check them out, please use my links in my website or the links from the description of any of my YouTube videos. So I've got courses on all basic math. I've actually got two courses on differential equations. So um, there's a lectures course, which has longer videos, and there's just the regular course, which has shorter videos. But in terms of content, they're very similar. Um, you might get some different examples in each. Um, which one should you get? I say get both. But they're, they're both different, and they have assignments. That's the key difference. You actually have assignments that you can do. So, yeah, it's a course. But, yeah.
Hopefully this has been helpful. Differential equations is a really cool subject. Um, I think it's awesome. Oh, and if you use Instagram, check me out at The Real Math Sorcerer. And of course, subscribe. These are all things I'm trying to remember to say after every video. <laughs> so yeah, great book though. I like it. It's a cool vintage book. Take care.